a fit person walked out of the gym, so I smiled at them and they looked at me like I was a weirdo. And I was like, what? I'm well hot. Got a Pokemon t-shirt on. But then it's okay because some hillbillies bid me. Standards. Rachel, it's Thursday. Um, first of all, we're really sorry because whenever there's a holiday we end up kind of messing up our weeks a bit and because Rachel, well, I was about to say we, but Rachel posted so much Scotland. I did film over the Easter but I thought there was no point uploading it. So, um, this video is going to be, I think I'll finish, I'll, I'll show you a bit of this week and then I'll just show you some Easter stuff which is a bit outdated now, but enjoy uh, I'm really excited to come and see you at the weekend I have, I have my film exam on the 16th and then my deadlines on the 18th but then after that I'll just be like because I only have like business really to worry about so I'm so excited for that day to arrive here's your stuff that I have to bring and look check this McDonald's and you have a McDonald's one because Mine's for a McMuffin and yours is for porridge and Harriet's brought me in another one for McMuffin and we'd be like, yo, McMuffin's minus the meat and if they're like, no, we're like, yo, that's racist to vegetarians and then they'd be like, whoa, and they'd be like, yeah You think your ringtone's cool? Check out mine All these lies, Jen This is exactly what happened with the Iraq war Pretty catchy and not all weird Hello Rachel, it's Saturday and I'm at Tim's and we were, we were out, we've just come in and we went to go in this door and there was keys in the porch we were like what? and we came out and it unlocks this okay, random cool. car Cheers Do you want a car? Alright, see you later dad Bye We're on this daddy to Hello Rachel to <laughs> Just ring them up and do you want me to talk to them? You don't have to say no, do you? Oh, I want to talk to them because I don't know what I want to I've pre-rehearsed in my head what to say I really want to look in the car. We can't film now. <laughs> I'm going to see my other neighbours. Stop. It's so exciting. It's very exciting. I really want to go out for a drive. In that car. Yeah. It's joyful. I like. I'd like a full focus. Full, oh, I'd like a full focus. Full fiesta. Oh. Do you want a drink? You were really thirsty. Oh no, it's too exciting. The excitement. <laughs> Do you want to stop filming? It's parked outside my house. All right, cool. Someone should have told me. All right. What a twat. Don't be mean. She's been right, an idiot. Wait, wait, no, what happened was. Um, her parents have gone out for the day and they couldn't, they couldn't leave the car anywhere so they've left it here or some bullshit, I don't know. What's wrong with their drive? I don't know where they live. They've gone out to ride it. I don't know. It's weird people. No, you don't know anything I'm about... No, 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 listen, <laughs> listen, 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 listen. No, you don't know anything about the story, so... Easter, Easter, Easter stuff. Woo! This is for Mum and Dad. I got Tim a white chocolate one and it says Tim. I wanted to write your yummier. But the lady was like, just write down what you want to be written. And I was like, shit, I don't have to spell yummier. So I was like, I'll just write it. And it was um, sad. Because it just goes to show how my difficulty has... Um, I can't even think of that word I'm trying to think of. Compromised. That's the word. So I'm going to share with you a long life skill which I have um, acquired and developed and really like definitely heavily relied upon over my life and it's the art of um, paper basketry which is making these really classy baskets out of just paper and a few bits and you can like put nice things in them, give them and be like yo we made you a basket and people tend to um, respond really well to the baskets I make. They often say, wow, where did you buy this? Um, nice staples, good rips. So step one of your basketeering voyage, you need to cut slits into the paper. You can measure, but I'm just going by, um, this isn't the length of the scissor things and just going half 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 so they're about this big do the same on the other side as you get more confident and uh come to terms with the technique you can do it as quick as i can but i understand you may want to take your time 
as a learner because you don't have the knowledge that I've. I'm going to put it out there. We are going for staples. It's effective and it just it's like showing off a tool that you have. Like, yeah, I've got a stapler. I'm supervised when I use it because I'm dangerous. So you just have to join up all of the edges like this. It can be quite difficult as they often move around and they don't really join up in the same place. I've stapled my finger before. So as you can see, pretty well formed curve. So um good basket. So then just do the same to the other side. You can easily add extra details without a lot of hassle. Wham! Oops. Don't gush on staples, basically. Oh, fuck. You know what? There we go. Love it. Look at that. Look at that class. Perfect. Really good, that. I'm feeling creative, so I'm just gonna find and be stick some bows into Tim's gift. Genius. Yeah, you're cool, twat.